Ako si Selina at ako ay isang suicide survivor. Ako si Barbara at ako ay isang survivor ng domestic violence. Ako si Lorenti Amiel O. Agustin and I'm a cancer warrior. I felt like this gave a more mature side of Darren. Yeah, to be honest. they showed a different Actually, side of Darren. Darren told us a little while back that um, he wanted this song to be more more serious than is usual. Mm -hmm. so. It hits a lot of different spots. Um, depression. Um, mental illness. Meta mental illness from... The uh, so, yeah. Mm. No, I mean like it all hell. Yeah, it's all about yeah, emotional, yeah, yeah, mental health. Yeah. Because of different kinds of problems mm -hmm. from domestic violence, from suicide, to of course cancer. I'm happy that Darren finally He's using his platform mm -hmm. to show everyone Most things like this are happening. A lot of people look up to Darren. A lot of people look up to Darren, and I'm happy that he's using his platform in a good way. Mm -hmm. And it's really uplifting, it's really inspiring. Mm -hmm. Not just to people that are going through the same problems, but to the people who are not going through anything, but they still feel like there's always going to be a better tomorrow because of this kind And of there's always going to be a light at the end of the tunnel. Yeah. Yeah. Can, can I just, can I just add this? Uh, on yeah. a real real based on a real experience my friend actually has this friend who really likes Darren mm -hmm. and this person really had depression in school and it's just like helped him a lot yeah mm -hmm. but then actually that person really likes Darren like mm -hmm. that person really idolizes Darren and then she was able to survive depression got through depression because of Darren and yeah I know was a able lot to of graduate people. yeah mm -hmm. a but lot of people, people go through, through a lot of things and they try finding a certain yeah. person to help them through that and Darren is one of, in our generation, is one of the number one people to go to when you're trying to look for happiness in music and stuff like that. And I'm happy that he's able to actually attack, because before he doesn't even try to attack that, <laughs> that uh, like issue. But at least now he's showing everyone that. Sasa and can that. you believe he wrote that song? Yeah, I know, right? I'm so like. He wrote it. It was on his. To his audience. Yeah. The audience that idolize him, that like him. They were able to receive that message on a personal note because yeah. it was written by him. Like social media, if it's used in the right way, it can sa mga people who have depression, may anxiety, and mental illness. But it's also because sometimes what you see on social media are also things that are more affected by the situation of a person. If they filter what they see on Instagram, like sa Instagram, sa Facebook, or Twitter, then it will help a lot. And as long as their circle of friends or of course their family are all very supportive sa taong yun, um, then I feel like makatulong din yun sa, sa pag-connect sa kanila sa social media and all that. Talk to someone. It really helps to talk to someone and to vent out to someone. Talagang uh, mas okay yun na nilalabas mo yung nararamdaman mo, yung feelings mo. Okay lang yun talaga, wag kang wag, like a lot of people kasi iniisip nila na parang baka sabihing nagiiinarte lang sila pero it's not kasi talagang totoo yun yung depression, yung anxiety. Hey po, ano pong masasagipin kita stories ninyo? Just comment them down below and we'd appreciate them and uh, I'll be reading them as well. Again, maraming maraming salamat po and I hope you guys like sasagipin kita stories. Thank you.